So we have driven, no, driven, drove, driven? drove into the big city of Charlotte to check out the Charlotte Hornets, the NBA. The Charlotte Hornets have let people back in the stadium a small, a small little bit. And so we bought some tickets. We're gonna go check out LaMelo Ball. Woohoo! Go cheer on the Hornets and show you around the Spectrum Center. It's a great place to watch a basketball game and let you know how the old, what kind of COVID or kind of- And I'm gonna audition for the honeybees. Okay. Oh yeah, all right. <laughs> Let's go check it out. these cool bobbleheads life yes, size like big ones could not like express my excitement so clearly <laughs> i had to have a moment <laughs> she, she is hamming it up and then the the spectrum center is awesome the, i love the court and the honeycombs they have on there for the the charlotte hornets and the jumbotron you literally i catch myself watching the games more on the I jumbotron, the jumbotron more, more, the more than i do that what's going on in the actual court so we paid right under 20 bucks for these seats. Real, real good seats. We're like letter G on the second second deck here. But you got a real good view. We're kind of in the corner. I'll flip the camera around here in a second so you can see, have a good idea what our view is from up here. So good seats. Oh yeah, they can see the whole park. It's great. Yep. So three things you need to know. Um, for coming to an NBA game here, especially here in Charlotte, North Carolina. All right, number one. So, uh, new rule is you cannot bring in a purse, or a purse that's bigger than a 10 by 10. So, so, so ladies, if you're coming to the game with your man, uh, just wear a crossbody, or he has pockets, just hand him all yeah, your stuff to carry. Leave the purse in the car. All right, number two. They have a little uh, or form you gotta fill out. It takes less than a minute. Yeah, um, they've got little QR codes for you to scan. It's their health screening, and then you just have to have an app on your phone that says you've been cleared. Yep. All right, number three, and this is real important. Um, you can't come in any entrance you want right now. So on your ticket, your mobile ticket, you're, it's gonna say which entrance to come into, and so just uh, look for that before you come to the game, so you know uh, where kind of where to park and where your entrance is at to get into the game. Yeah, I watched him turn a guy around for me in the wrong line. So yep. make sure you the right way. <laughs> so one big plus with all this going on is there is plenty of room to spread out. Yes. And so you don't have to stand up every couple seconds to let someone cross in front of you. No. Awesome. And my legs, I can spread my long legs out. I'm not all jacked up in the seat. I know, my feet are actually in the seat in front of me. <laughs> so that is a huge plus right now. Big plus. So you can see how they got seats reserved. Lots of empty seats. And then there's that lady. This might be the biggest escalator I've ever been on in my life. Yeah, it's massive. <laughs> it's really big. Yeah, it's like three miles. Three miles? <laughs> it's kind of eerie in a way, walking around and there is no one out on the concourse at all. Just shows you how empty everything is right now. Kind of crazy. That's kind of sad. I love me some dipping Dots now. It's good, doesn't it? This is fine. This jersey is awesome. I love that one. Why don't you share with everyone your cheer you were just doing? <laughs> I don't think that works. It does work. You have enough people and you're loud. I don't have enough people. I don't have enough support. Other cities do this. But one thing that's really cool is the buildings, the big buildings here downtown, they'll light themselves up on game days, you know, at the horn when the Hornets are playing or the Panthers and stuff with the team colors. So that's always, oh, 
Do they do that at Christmas? Yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> so it is definitely a different MBA experience. It is the strangest professional sporting event I've attended. <laughs> for those who've watched the movie Major Leagues, I feel like that's what it's like. Like you're at it, like the players can hear everything that you say. The refs can hear everything you say. There's maybe about 3,000 people in the whole stadium. So it feels like that you're watching a team that has lost like every game they play in the last 40 years <laughs> yes and like only the diehards are there so it is it is a wild experience yeah it's probably the quietest i've ever yeah had this I, I, I can i can't even imagine being a player and just there's no energy right now so it's 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 a very interesting experience but um just, if you just follow those tips we gave you before, earlier it'll really help you when you come to um the hornets and i'm, I'm sure it's probably like that any other nba game so bye, bye.